I think the core difference between Bucket Feet and all other footwear companies is that every single product we make is a collaboration. There's a different person, a different place, a different story behind every single product we make. That will never change. It's really core to who we are and core to why we do what we do. Raja and I met in Buenos Aires, in Argentina. Uh, we both were there for different reasons in the country. I had moved there, Raja was doing around the world trip. I told him about the shoe customizing idea I had. He designed me a pair of shoes that I wore as I traveled around the world, and everywhere I went, those shoes inspired incredible conversations. It always came back to the story behind the product and the person behind the product. And when I finished traveling, I reached back out to Aaron and told him I wanted to start a company with the idea of bringing people together. And we thought that a unique, fun one way to do that would be through shoes. Creativity, curiosity, and connectivity are sort of the three main pillars that laid the foundation for what Bucket Feet is today. People want to feel connected to someone or something, but they don't want just a fleeting conversation. They want a real connection. Art is something that two people that have nothing in common can have a mutual understanding and a mutual respect for. We're using shoes, but shoes are sort of the platform. Art is that bridge that allows Bucket Feet as a brand to bring people together. If there's one thing I would want consumers to know about Bucket Feet, it's that every single product you see is designed by a different artist. Our artists really provide the stories that allow our brand to connect with people all over the world. And so our artist community is something that's critical to the success of this business. And we really live and die by how well we're able to support the artist community, work with artists, and make them feel like they're a part of our mission. So artists get an upfront fee. They also get royalties in perpetuity for as long as their shoes are for sale. The money is a nice component, but it's by no means what drives artists to be a part of the brand, and, and that matters to us a lot, so it makes us feel more invested and really try to, to get them that, that exposure. One of the coolest things is someone will post a photo, I'm so excited about these shoes, I'm walking around in Tokyo with them, we'll tag the artist that designed it, create you know this cool little moment where the, the artist can then communicate with the consumer. So really everything we do, we're, we're trying to figure out a way to connect with us. We believe art is for everyone. We want to make sure that anybody can come in and try their hand at designing some bucket feet, showcasing their art. Yeah, we hope, you know, in five years we can look back and say, you know, we really stayed true to this mission and we are doing better than we, we could have imagined.